Hi church. Uh, okay, this is not my testimony. It's one of my guys from KL2. Okay, uh, his name is Joseph. He's now back in Uganda, so I share behalf with him. Okay, about four years ago, I was playing rugby with my friends and the team when I was suffered a very unfortunate injury in which I damaged my knee ligaments and dislocated my knee and the lower leg bone. It was painful and horrifying. And the school sent me back home instead of straight to the hospital. And it was only after my father saw the condition of my leg that I was sent straight to hospital much later on. At that point in time, my leg had already swelled pretty badly. Later in the hospital, all I could think was whether I could ever walk again. The doctor was not particularly encouraging. However, I got to walk again but with a limb and never the same again. I have had the pain in my knee for four and a half, four plus years. I couldn't walk or stand for a long time. I had to wear knee cap holders for, for the whole time and it's not the most comfortable comfortable thing to wear. But it gave me a relief considering that I took every medication they asked me to and nothing's changed. Uh, I wore shorts to prayer, prayer service uh, last time, a few weeks back. Uh, when we were done, I was adjusting my kneecap holder when one of my homies, Vincent, saw it and asked, what's the matter? Uh, what's, uh, what's the matter with my knee? So I told him that it was a permanent effect from my accident a long time back. He asked me if I ever had prayed for healing. I said no. Uh, in my head, I was thinking, does he even know how long, I've, uh, how long it has been or what I've endured? I've come to a place that where I accepted the permanence of my problem. He placed his hand uh, over my knee and prayed for healing. Worship in church can be passionate and long, and my knee couldn't handle the... I couldn't handle the, the standing for a long moment, so I have to place my hand on the seats in front of me while standing on one leg just to relieve the pressure from my knee. During reunion finale in stadium, while pastor was praying for healing, I just thought it would be nice to walk again without, and to run without pain. After reunion, me and my friends walked to stadium, from Stadium Gara to Sungai Wang. I realized that there was pain in my knee, but this time it wasn't from the knee but it was the kneecap holder that, that felt suffocating to the knee, so I immediately took it off and walked home without it on until I reached home. At that point... At that, at that point, I didn't even think about uh, that my prayer is answered, but I knew something has changed. Something was different. I wanted to believe that healing had already taken place and decided that when I woke up on the next day for my final exam, that I would not wear the kneecap holder for the day. I got through it the day just fine. In fact, the whole week without it. I also went through uh, two hours of futsal on Sunday just for confirmation. And, and, it, and it came through without any pain. The joy and relief has been unimaginable and I can certainly say I have been healed. I feel alive and new. Praise be to Lord.